I put this lipstick on just for you. Hello fellow creatives. I'm here to admit wholeheartedly that I have accountability issues. I love painting and I love doing art, but I have a hard time doing it every single day with intention. So to try and combat my accountability issues, I am challenging myself for the month of August to do two projects. The two projects are VEDA, Vlog Every Day in August. Vlog Every Day in August is a challenge to do a video blog on my YouTube channel every day in August. But let's face it, I don't find my life all that interesting to vlog every day. So I was trying to figure out how I could get in on this project. And then I came across a 30 day project on Instagram where an artist designs or creates something every day for 30 days. And they either blog about it or post it on Instagram. So I figured if I combine those two things, then I could hold myself accountable and have a reason to put up a video every day. I was walking the other day with my neighbor as we walk every morning with our dogs. And I was just telling her to, that I was trying to figure out what this project was gonna be. And then she told me that she loved my elephant paintings and I love my elephant paintings and I love painting my elephant paintings. So I figure if I'm gonna do something every single day for 30 days, then it's gotta be something that I love. See, look at ah, elephant shirt. I just simply love elephants. Let me tell you a story about why I love elephants. When I was little, I was probably about nine years old, I went to a zoo and there was a baby elephant. And after the zoo did their whole show, then I got to go up and see the elephant and the, the trainer told me that if I blow into the elephant's trunk, it will blow back and that's how they say hello. So this little baby elephant put his little trunk in between the rails and I got to hold it and it was really prickly. If you've ever touched an elephant's skin, they're actually really tough and prickly. But they're the sweetest little thing. So I got to hold this little trunk and I blew in it and it blew back at me. And even though it was kind of snotty and warm and gross, it was the thing that captured my heart for elephants for the rest of my life. So here's how the whole thing is gonna to come together. I'm going to videotape me doing the paintings every day and then post them as a tutorial or a voiceover or a time-lapse video on YouTube. And that will be my daily video as well as my 30-day art project. I'm really excited, but a little intimidated. I don't know how I'm gonna make this all work, but I'm excited for the challenge. To make sure you don't miss a thing, be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel or tune into the hashtag 30 days of painted elephants and I'll see you starting August 1st.